Hello YouTube and hi friends, this is Jimmy aka Swedish Survivor in Life and Life. Uh, I thought I would offer you a short glimpse and a short video uh, of this uh, yet another again. <laughs> uh, a new Kaiser prototype knife that I received a couple of months back. Uh, this is a really nice piece. Uh, collaboration knife with the TK knives. Uh, and this knife belongs to the Vanguard series basically so it's a bit cheaper materials G10 scales uh, yeah and so on and so on uh, one thing that is basically an exception here that this knife comes with a, a S35B in blade instead of a VG10 blade uh, but, but there is in fact another uh, another knife uh, um, another version of this knife and it belongs to the bladesmith line and this uh, this knife is named Kyre uh, and uh, it's a collaboration uh, with TK knives here you see the stainless pocket clip there uh, it has uh, nested stainless steel liners that is drilled on one side uh, they have managed to remove quite a lot of materials actually to reduce weight uh, it's an OD green uh, G10 scales uh, like I said with the uh, nested liners looks very good uh, really clean look with uh, only the G10 showing basically uh, it's a pillar construction open knife with the two standoffs basically here in the in the bottom stainless steel torx bits for screw heads uh, there you can see kaiser logo and s35 vn and the model name there uh, and this knife is one of the exceptions in the vanguard series they usually comes or usually boasts a vg10 blade and this has a 35 vn instead the flipping action, as always with Kaiser knives, is very good. Uh, all their knives flip very nice. It, does, it doesn't matter if it, they have ball bearings or if they have regular washers, in my mind. Uh, the one with washer just have a little longer of a breaking period, uh, in my mind. Because they do manage to get their detents perfect each and every time. And that's the... Yeah, I mean the flipper geometry is really really important. The the geometry of the flipper tab and in in what angle it has and how much of a, a material sticking out and everything that do factor in quite a lot in a in a knife with a good flipping action. But the detent is also very important for a knife with a good action and and a, a good flipping capabilities basically. Uh, basically a flat grind blade uh, as you see from basically up there and all the way down really thin behind the edge as well and the edge is straight uh, no fuck ups <laughs> sorry for my language uh, no funkiness straight sharp as a razor as always really f fat pivot point there uh, they are using the new the new washer system that they have basically using they basically that they are using on some models this is still um, ball bearings but like the Odino from um, um, Viper by Technocut uh, they have as you can see in here you can see it looks like washers basically bronze washers so they have ball bearings inside and they have the washers on top of the ball bearings and a blade between so the action is very good uh, I have to say I mean it's smooth as butter flipping action terrific uh, you can open it really easy with a little little <laughs> thumb hole the quite large uh, thumb hole there uh, you can use the finger flick if you would like that uh, kind of good centering, not perfect, but not bad either. Uh, 
this particular knife is they have used thread lockers on the pivot point so uh, I didn't want to mess that up because this knife isn't mine so I I, I haven't touched this knife uh, a bit basically yeah the, the pocket clip as you can see there in stainless steel there you can see TK knives logo uh, one position you can't move it uh, um, yeah what else what have I forgotten uh, yeah like I said this knife is named Kair and uh, yeah collaboration piece between TK knives and Kaiser knives from the Vanguard series but with the better steel in S35 VN I think this knife will sell quite well for Kaiser they also have a bladesmith a version of this with the fluted titanium handle scales that looks amazing actually it looks quite nice I do not know for a hundred percent I should have looked in the catalog before this video I'm so sorry guys but I don't I do not know if this S35 VN will stay on the production version of this knife because this is the prototype but um, if not it will have a VG10 blade and that's not nothing to laugh about it's very good performing steel but uh, I think they will still keep holding on to this 35 VN because it would make no it would make no sense sending out S35 VN blades to the prototype prototypes testers like myself and then change it before releasing it it, it that would be really strange <laughs> actually uh, so there it is the the TK knives collaboration with Kaiser knives the Kair uh, with the G10 uh, OD green G10 scales nested stainless steel liners drilled uh, quite a lot open pillar construction stainless steel clip like I said uh, uh, it's basically a two washer system ball bearings and washers smooth as yeah really really smooth so there you have it a first glimpse at the Kaiser Kair uh, collaboration with TK knives and this video has been held in English just because I haven't seen another video of this knife yet on YouTube and as you all know when I when I am uh, the first or among the first I usually do it in English too yeah to to offer a lot of uh, a bigger audience a chance to 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 look at this knife well, my dear friends, it's time to punch in the clock, basically, uh, heading for work. So, until we, we hear from each other again, thanks a lot, guys, for watching. If you like this video, please press the like button. If you aren't a subscriber yet, please be. Uh, that would really make me, make me happy. Uh, and until next time, take care of yourself and each other. And as always... Stay sharp.